Brittany, I'll never forget the first time I saw you when you walked out on that stage at UNF to sing. I'm already gonna cry. You really stood out and I'll always remember that experience. I'll never forget the first time we had cheesecake together in New York. And after I got up, your friend told you that I was totally in love with you. I didn't know it yet, but I totally was. <laughs> I'll never forget the first time we talked about the possibility of getting married and how impossible it seemed at the time. And here we are. I could sit here and write about how gorgeous you are, how your eyes sparkle and your smile lights up my life. I could talk about how intelligent you are, how great of a teacher you are, or how beautifully you sing but I would be writing for days. Brittany, you walked out of a dream. You are an answer to prayer. You compliment me in every way. You are the greatest thing that has ever happened to me, my greatest blessing, my little everything. <laughs> God has blessed us immeasurably, and I can't wait to see what he has in store for us for the next 80 years and beyond. I love you, B, forever yours. <laughs> so sweet. <laughs> Cameron, I can't believe it's our wedding day. It feels like we've been together forever, and yet I know we're just getting started. Remember when we went to look at rings with stars in our eyes, knowing we'd probably never be able to afford anything nice? I still remember the day at the top of the World Trade Center, you knelt down on one knee and looked up at me only to start tying your shoe. I will never forget all the times I couldn't wait to get off the plane to see you standing there with a huge smile on your face. You have always been someone I can talk to about anything. Someone who cheers me on no matter how many times I fall on my face and someone who holds me accountable to be a more loving and Christ-like person. I know we agreed not to write vows, but I want you to know some of what I would have said. I vow to help you love life, to always hold you with tenderness, and to have the patience that love demands, to speak when words are needed, and to share the silence when they are not to value and protect your heart, to always call it home. I vow to fiercely love you in all your forms now and forever. I promise never to forget that this is lifelong. I vow to love you no matter what challenges threaten to tear us apart. We will always fight harder to maintain oneness. I promise to pray for you, laugh with you, snuggle you, chase the Lord with you, and I promise not to roll my eyes at every dad joke you tell. And I promise to be bone of your bones and flesh of your flesh until God calls us home. Till my, till my last breath, Brittany's trying. Having uh, now committed before the Lord, your love to one another, and your promise to live as he has said. It's my joy to announce that you are husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. most appreciate. The father thing happened 27 some years ago and um, so that's a, a lifelong relationship that can't be changed. Uh, the best man thing however was not guaranteed and may be my finest honor bestowed on me by uh, the man on the planet that I love and admire most. And Brittany is a unique and beautiful person. I have never met anyone like her. She is incredibly smart, sincere, wildly intuitive. If 
vivacious, a bundle of fun, and a wonderful musician. Brittany, what a stunningly beautiful bride you are.